author of book formula of happiness the secret within you well so this is my short introduction and uh, uh, i have written book Uh, and uh, i do uh, live workshops and online workshop i help people in building their dream life and i help them to building their emotional mental and spiritual well-being because these are these three parts of our life is very very important uh, to have that you know successful life or to have growth in our life right so i help people in this thing So, if you want to know more about me, you can check my website as well. It is uh, www. monica singh. dot co. dot in. So, इससे पहले कि हम आगे बढ़ें और कुछ बात करें हम failures के बारे में, उससे पहले मैं जानना चाहूँगी कि आप क्या सोचते हैं success success के बारे में. What is the meaning of success for you and how you actually define it? So, आप अपना on कर सकते हैं, because I cannot see. Uh, what you guys are typing so just ek ek person koi bhi on kare apna mic and just let me have an idea from you what you guys think of success kya aapke liye jo bhi success hai uska kya matlab hai actually mein? what do you understand with the word success anybody just raise your hand and uh, you can explain yourself yahan pe kuch bhi right or wrong nahi hoga it is just opinion right we all are here to share ideas what we feel and what we think okay so there is no wrong and right just on your mic and let me know what you guys think of the word success anybody um can yes. i try monica yes yes i can hear you okay it's vijit um for me success is the accomplishment of goal or uh, you know like the aim uh, oh. or kind of like yeah accompl- accomplishment of what we want to do perfect perfect so anybody else who wants to give their meaning of the word success hi monica yes hi yeah i am ajit from tamil nadu hi manjeet i can hear you yes yeah, success changes every day success is mm-hmm. something that at the end of the day what makes you happy is the success on that day all right i understand i perfect so anybody else who wants to give their understanding about the word success uh, hi monica uh, myself hi. and pooja hi uh, monica according to me success is uh, making a right choice I'm okay. going the right path, like which will uh, get you success or which will give you success. Perfect, perfect. Anybody else here with us? Good evening, ma'am. Hello. Hi. Oh, sorry. <laughs> okay. Uh, success is success is achieving our short-term aim or a long-term aim. Okay. Perfect. Yes. Next. Hello. Yes. I believe success is attaining a state where we can get self satisfaction in the end. Nice, nice. So well, uh, thank you so much for the opinion and the ideas and the understanding uh, about the success. And. Uh, absolutely success is you know uh, it is just a word first of all and whatever we think about the success it is uh, we'll say it is the opinion right aur life mein bahut sare alag alag tarike ki perceptions hain bahut tarike ki alag ideas hain to isliye main aap logo se janna chahti thi what exactly you think about the success right to Hello am i the only one who cannot uh, listen to monica's voice no even i can't no no even i can't mom Ma, maybe you're am i audible now am i yeah. audible yeah. now okay. yeah perfect. now you are audible perfect 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 thank you so much so yes as i was saying uh, meaning of success is actually different uh, from for different different people right we all think differently about the word success बट uh, आप इससे पहले भी बहुत सारी वर्कशॉप ले चुके होंगे और इसके बाद भी आप बहुत सारी लेंगे एक्चुअली वर्कशॉप्स 
और आपको अलग अलग तरीके से सक्सेस के बारे में जानने के लिए मिलेगा सो वी आर हेयर नॉट टू एक्चुअली जज एनी बडी एंड वी आर नॉट टू हेयर प्रूव एनी थिंग रॉन्ग और राइट हेयर इट इज ऑल अबाउट परसेप्शन राइट सो वॉट आई फील अबाउट द वर्ड परसेप्शन इन माई लैंग्वेज और my words and what i feel about the word success is something also different so i'll give you the i'll give you my perception about the success okay so hum yahan pe actually i bhi isliye hai right so that we can gain the different perception right har koi alag alag bolta hai aur aapne bahut bar alag alag baat suni hogi success ke bare mein but here today i uh, i'm here to share my ideas right so let's move what i feel about the word success for me success is all about efficiency efficiency and the acceleration in the life right uh, efficiency and acceleration means you have speed when you get success you get actually speed in your life and uh, acceleration ka means speed right aapki speed badh jati hai jab bhi aap kisi bhi cheez mein success hasil karte hain aapki efficiency badh jati hai aap bahut zyada efficient ho jate hain wo kaam karne ke liye सक्सेस का मतलब ये तो नहीं है दी एंड राइट सक्सेस एक एक्चुअली एक और नई शुरुआत है एक नई बिगिनिंग है तो सक्सेस इज नॉट दी नॉट दी एंड दी ऑफन फील कि सक्सेस मिल गई मींस लाइफ खत्म और शायद मैं उसके बाद में कुछ आगे करूंगा नहीं हिमालय में चला जाऊंगा और कुछ यू नो साधना वादना शुरू कर दूंगा ऐसा तो नहीं होता राइट right? सक्सेस के बाद में सक्सेस के बाद में एक्चुअली हमारी एक दूसरी लाइफ स्टार्ट होती है and uh, which is more efficient and which is uh, you know more speedy hamari life mein speed badh jati hai aur success kya hai uh, life ke alag alag hisson mein hame chahiye hoti hai chahe success ki baat kare hum career mein job mein relationship mein hamare finances mein hamari health mein we all want success in all these areas right and uh, jab bhi hum koi goal set karte hain aur us goal ko achieve karne ki koshish karte hain to hum actually mein kya achieve कोशिश कर रहे होते हैं सक्सेस मीन्स वट यू गाइज आर एक्चुअली ट्राइंग टू अचीव वेन यू सेट गोल्स फॉर योर सेल्फ यू एक्चुअली ट्राइंग टू अचीव द एफिशियंसी यू आर एक्चुअली ट्राइंग टू अचीव द एक्सलरेशन सो दैट आपकी स्पीड बढ़ जाए लाइफ में राइट जो अभी काम धीरे धीरे हो रहा है वो थोड़ा सा स्पीडी हो जाए यही है है ना राइट सक्सेस का मतलब सो दिस इज वॉट आई फील अबाउट द सक्सेस सक्सेस जो है आपकी लाइफ का एंड नहीं हो जाता है वहां से लाइफ की एक नई शुरुआत होती है जहां से आप एक नई पर्सनालिटी बन के उभर के बाहर आते हैं सो वील टॉक अबाउट दिस मोर अहेड बट बिफोर दैट लेट मी टेक वन पोल सो डिफरेंट डिफरेंट एरियाज वी हैव इन आर लाइफ राइट करियर जॉब रिलेशनशिप फाइनेंस एंड हेल्थ सो दीज आर सम फ्यू मेन यू नो मेन एरियाज ऑफ आर लाइफ वेर वी ऑल आर लुकिंग फॉर द सक्सेस so as i cannot see what you guys are typing so just let me hear from you uh, you are looking for the success in which area of of your life is it career job or business is it your relationship is it your finances is it your health let me know you that in which area of your life you are actually looking for the success just open your mic and speak up just give one option and mute your mic all right so let's study health health perfect i'm for me career job and business perfect anybody else career perfect yes hmm. yeah kind of career okay ma'am for me it's career overall for me <laughs> okay no problem i can hear one voice Yes, please. Anybody else? Anyways, ज्यादा तर जो हमें अभी ऑप्शन मिला वो मिला है करियर का राइट करियर जॉब एंड बिजनेस द फर्स्ट हेलो यस मोनिका कैन यू स्पीक इन इंग्लिश बिकॉज लॉट ऑफ ऑडियंस इज बिलोंग टू डिफरेंट रीजन टू Okay, no problem. So, what area in your life you are looking for the career? Uh, I mean, you are looking for the success. We have different different areas in our life, and we all are looking for the 
success in all those different areas and uh, i really want to hear from you guys that in which area of your life you are looking for the success is it career job or business is it relationship is it finances or is it your health just open your mic and let me know what area of your life you are looking for the success yes mom maybe all of them they all are saying career i i can actually have the idea because i get the most of the answer from the people they all are saying the career most of them are saying career right so we'll uh, uh, focus we'll focus our you know speech or the talk on the career all right so let's take one more another poll it is more of uh, an opinion poll where you just have to give me your agreement or disagreement all right so just because i cannot see uh, what you guys are typing so i would love to hear this from you okay just say uh, agree or disagree strongly agree or strongly disagree and let me hear from this uh, uh, this from you so i am going to read a uh, few statements here for, for you guys okay and you just have to uh, share your opinion what you feel about this uh, word phrase or line all right are we ready i guess yes <coughs> okay so first statement says repeatedly failure means i can't do statement agree strongly agree disagree or strongly disagree strongly, strongly disagree. disagree strongly disagree all right anybody else agree this all right disagree anybody all right perfect anybody disagree perfect all right so let me hear uh, let me hear from you for the next statement and next statement says only lucky people get success what you feel about it are you agree are you strongly agree are you disagree or are you strongly disagree with the phrase or line only strongly lucky disagree. people get success strongly disagree 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 and um perfect so most of the people said disagree so it's absolutely true luck ka success ke sath mein kuch bhi lena dena hai hi nahi but uh, you know sometimes we feel ek you know andar koi na koi belief zarur hota hai ki usko success mil gayi it means somewhere it his luck or it's her luck right somewhere we do feel about it so in you know uh, in a very uh, we can say um, in real reality or in real life luck ka kuch lena dena nahi hai success is success is like you people do something and they get success right they when you keep doing something you automatically get the some uh, get success but when you quit for uh, doing anything you have actually get people uh, you know people are not defeated by anything else outside they are defeated by the you know Uh, by by the fear of uh, the failure you know they quit actually in between that's why they get un uh, they get you know unsuccessful so all right let's move to the next phrase or next line that says uh, failure means i don't deserve the future i want for myself so let me hear from you guys what you feel about this phrase this line are you agree are you strongly agree are you disagree or are you strongly disagree Failure strongly. means I don't deserve the future I want for myself. Yes. I strongly disagree. Strongly disagree. Right. Disagree. I strongly disagree. 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 Perfect. Perfect. So many disagreement uh, for this statement. Uh, failure means I don't deserve the future I want for myself. Sometimes people never stop us for doing anything. It's it's us actually who. who stop ourselves for doing anything maybe we make bahanas or we make uh, you know some um, some tricks with ourselves that okay maybe my parents are not uh, you know liking my career that's why i want to quit maybe my girlfriend my partner my boyfriend they don't want me to do this and maybe my friends are saying i i i am not good at this and i cannot do it so maybe i should quit doing this so maybe people are saying so many things outside of you but it always uh, success is always about what you feel about uh, 
you. If you feel about that you deserve something, then my friend, you actually can achieve anything in the life. As a human, you are unlimited. You are, uh, your potentials are unlimited. You can do anything and almost everything. You know, whatever in the whole wide world is happening right now. Some people are, you know, are CEO. Some people are founders. Some people are um, making themselves a big companies. Mm, becoming billionaires and millennials so they all are becoming all those things uh, and uh, if you are thinking you cannot do it then my friend you are not different from those uh, successful people you are the same human like them and this human mind is actually uh, you know you have power with you so if you feel positive about yourself if you feel uh, some good about uh, your goals and your aims and your success, then you actually can achieve anything. You can become anyone in the world. Whatever is happening, you have that capacity. If uh, if you feel I cannot do it right now, it's okay. You can learn to do it because uh, you can learn anything, right? You can learn to do anything. All you have to think about what you want to become, right? All right, let's move to the next phrase that says, uh, failing means I am not smart or capable. All right, we were just talking about the subject and we got the phrase. So yes, let me hear from you. Failing means I am not smart or capable. What do you feel about this statement? Are you agree, strongly, strongly agree, disagree. disagree? Perfect. Strongly yeah. disagree. disagree. Strongly disagree. Strongly disagree, strongly disagree ma'am. Strongly disagree. Oh. disagree. Wow, very, very positive people I got today in this webinar. Amazing. Just give yourself some, you know, round of applause. Ma'am, you are not audible. Ma'am, you are not audible. Yeah, Monica, you are not audible. Yeah, Monica, you are not audible. Okay, am I audible now? Yes. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma okay. Now yes. you are audible. Yes. yes, you guys can remind me whenever I, I'm stuck, okay? So, yes, failing uh, doesn't mean that you are not smart or capable. I just, uh, uh, you know, mentioned that this human mind is uh, very powerful, right? You can learn to do anything. You can learn to become anyone. It's about learning. Uh, you know, since your childhood till now, where, uh, you know, in whatever phase of your age, uh, you are at this moment you have learned so many things right and in future also you can learn so many things it's about learning if somebody is a uh, superior than you if somebody is on the bigger position than you that means he or she must have been learn all those things. so it's always about learning how you know a phone a mobile phone is nothing without the software or the application right so learning is like you know it's put learning always put a new software in your mind in your brain so you are uh, if another word we say you are exactly same like computer or the mobile or we can say and you know computer and mobiles are adapted by human brain and human mind so the more application and more software in one mobile can make it more smart then it's same like with you also if you you know put more learnings in your head you put more skills in your head you become or you automatically become smarter and you become automatically you know superior than people people are on bigger position are the people who actually learn a lot they have uh, you know they, they can they can do good uh, public speaking they can manage a crowd they can manage uh, their team they can manage your clients they can manage so many things right so it's always about what you are learning and you you are very smart to learn all and everything my friend so it's all about believing yourself in the beginning maybe you don't know how to do something but you can learn to do it right all right let's move to the next phrase that says if i already know i am going to fail in this then why try what do you feel about I strongly this disagree perfect I strongly no, no, disagree man strongly disagree disagree I strongly disagree disagree okay perfect perfect 
so yes if i already know why i if i already know i am going to fail in this then why try most of the time what happens actually maybe at this moment maybe mai kisi webinar mein hoti to shayad mai bhi bolti strongly disagree but on very unconscious level my friend this belief is always there within us that makes us feel that oh i am going to uh, you know get fail into this then why should i waste my time why should i do it anyway right we always and we often feel this way because life is not about bigger bigger experiences life is also about the smaller experience of the life if maybe on the bigger experiences of your life you are not feeling this way way but uh, on the smaller level of your life you are feeling this way then also this is working maybe if you means this will actually uh, help you to quit something <laughs> if you why people quit something uh it means they keep doing uh, or keep working on their dreams or their successes or their job or businesses or career but sometimes they quit in between it happens because they feel i'm trying so much and i'm always failing 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 and uh, if on the next move i'm going to fail then why should i try this even so that's why people quit in between so quitting actually is the result of thinking this way right so whenever you think i'm going to fail why try then you actually don't try you don't take any action right and when you are not taking any action how can that uh, you know uh, in action can take you to the success right in action don't take you to the success actions take you to the success right all right let me uh, read the next phrase for you and just let me know what you guys feel about it okay i saw people getting successes in one snap maine logo ko ek chutki mein successes hasil karte hue dekha hai what you feel about it disagree ma'am i agree ma'am partially disagree okay all right partially disagree okay So yes, we often think कि लोगों को सक्सेस बहुत ही ईजिली मिल रही है शायद एक चुटकी में और हम क्योंकि यू नो लोगों की सक्सेस के बारे में हमें कब पता चलता है जबकि वो एक्चुअली में सक्सेस हो जाते हैं राइट right? उससे पहले हमें जब भी वो अपने प्रोसेस में लगे होते हैं जब भी वो बिहाइंड द कर्टन होते हैं बिहाइंड द सीन होते हैं तब उस टाइम पे कोई न्यूज नहीं होती है नो बडी इज गोइंग वायरल दैट टाइम नो बडी इज टॉकिंग अबाउट दैम एंड नथिंग इज हैपनिंग राइट in behind the curtain behind the scene right so we all we often see people when they actually get the success but we never see what they are doing behind the scene so success is never happen in one snap it takes lot of patience it takes lot of hard work it takes uh, many years maybe so yes so people never get the successes in one snap my friend let me take your head thank you so much for this poll i am really glad that you guys are very very positive all right so yes what often we feel success is something like this like straight line where we start and we just get the success we often feel this way that success is a straight line but actually how it really looks like success is like this you just take you know you you start maybe you take wrong turn and then again you start and then again you take wrong turn or do some mistake or maybe you fail and then you again start and then you know when the cycle keeps happening and then ultimately you reach to the success right so success never happen in a one snap it always 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 take lot of uh, hard work and lot of time so it here is a cycle right we try we fail and then we try again and then we maybe fail again and then we try again and then we fail again so it's you know it's like we always trying 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 and then ultimately what happens we reach to the success so i would like to share you a story nowadays i am actually learning guitar okay so what happens when i start learning guitar so i didn't know where to keep my fingers where to you know because uh, to play uh, guitar chords you have to keep your fingers on some uh, chords and you have to make uh, e minor c minor or b minor things like that so when i was starting it was very 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 hard for me i 
sometime you know even my finger get hurt maybe you know my finger get some cut because of the wire of the guitar and uh, blood came out but i keep trying and then because i was hurting i was hurting my mind and my brain because this is always your success is always dependent on the how your mind is behaving in every pattern in everything actually your mind makes a pattern so it's not about how you are um, if you remember yourself if i take you to the childhood of yours so you remember how many times you fall before you get up properly on your two feet right and if you remember um, you know uh, when you try to eat your food it uh, in when you were so small so it used to go some sometime in your nose sometime in your eye sometime in your ear but it was never perfectly on the uh, mouth but slowly slowly you learn you fail many time to reach to the mouth so your mind learn okay okay this is the right place to go go to the food so that's how your mind learn things even in uh, your mind is same okay when you were 2 year old and when you are 20 year old or you know in next few years you'll be 200 year old so you know your mind will play the same thing your mind function your mind will function in a same way like it was you know behaving in your childhood it will it will keep behaving that way because that's how your mind works my friend so you know when i was playing guitar so it was happening ki mai bahut baar फेल हो रही थी अपने गिटार की कोड्स प्ले करने में हाथ कट गया खून निकल गया लेकिन मेरे माइंड ने सीख लिया कि ओके क्योंकि मैं इतनी बार फेल हुई हूँ अब ये तरीका नहीं है मेरे हाथ को गिटार के कोड्स पे रखने का क्योंकि मैं इस तरीके से हर्ट हुई थी तो फेलियर्स आर लाइक फेलियर्स आर लाइक यू नो लर्निंग अ प्रोसेस बिकॉज योर माइंड लर्न क्योंकि मुझे इस चीज से चोट लगी थी और मुझे अब इस तरीके से काम नहीं करना चाहिए तो वट हैपन्स वेन एवर यू फेल यू एक्चुअली लर्न अ लेसन नॉट मे बी यू कॉन्शियसली डोंट लर्न दैट लेसन बट योर माइंड माई फ्रेंड इट ऑलवेज लर्न द लेसन सो फेलियर इज ऑलवेज द लेसन फॉर यू अगर आप फेल नहीं होंगे योर माइंड विल नेवर एवर लर्न द लेसन इन अ वेरी फर्स्ट अटैम्प्ट नो बडी कैन डू एनी Nobody can do anything. अगर आप भी अपने आप को अपनी लाइफ को पीछे से चेक करते हुए आएंगे यूल सी कि आपने जितनी भी चीजें लाइफ में करते हुए आए हैं आप बहुत बार फेल हुए हैं उसमें नॉट जस्ट यू नो फिजिकली इवन मेंटली एंड इमोशनली भी क्योंकि आपका जो मेंटल प्रोसेस है वो इसी तरीके से काम करता है इट ऑलवेज वॉन्ट्स टू लर्न ऑल एंड एवरी थिंग इट ऑलवेज वॉन्ट्स टू लर्न इसीलिए आज जब हमें खाना यू you नो know, अब हमें पता चल गया ना सिर्फ हमें ये पता चला कि खाना मुंह में जाना चाहिए हमें ये भी पता चला अपने फेलियर से कि खाना आंख में नहीं जाना चाहिए राइट right? नाक में नहीं जाना चाहिए कान में नहीं जाना चाहिए तो ये सब चीजें हमने लर्न की है सेम हैपेंस विद द बिकॉज माइंड इज माइंड ओके इधर इट इज वर्किंग ऑन प्लेइंग गिटार और इट इज वर्किंग ऑन सम बिजनेस और योर करियर और योर जॉब और रिलेशनशिप और हेल्थ योर माइंड ऑलवेज वर्क इन अ सेम पैटर्न सेम वे सो that's why whenever you learn one thing uh, you know so it always apply on other things also so it uh, your mind behaves that way always my friend so failure is always a lesson for your mind always 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 a lesson for your mind so whenever you fail you act your mind takes a lesson and without taking that lesson you cannot do anything perfectly agar life mein ye janna zaruri hai ki ye cheez kaise karni hai to ye janna bhi bahut zaruri hai ki ye cheez ko kaise नहीं भी करना है राइट right? दोनों चीजें मैटर करती हैं कैसे करना है और कैसे नहीं करना है एंड योर माइंड वॉन्ट्स टू लर्न ऑल दिस प्रोसेस सो विदाउट फेलिंग विदाउट फेलिंग यू कैन नॉट अचीव एनी थिंग वेदर इट्स योर जॉब इट्स योर करियर इट्स योर बिजनेस इट्स योर रिलेशनशिप इट्स योर फाइनेंसेज फाइनेंसेज ऑल्सो आर लर्निंग हाउ टू मैनेज योर फाइनेंसेज राइट so let me ask you one thing suppose success is like a journey okay so let me ask you one thing aapne ek goal set kiya aapka ek goal hai ki aapko mumbai pahunchna hai ek train mein okay am i audible to you guys yes monica perfect suppose aap ek train mein baithe hue and you have one destination in your head and what is uh, suppose wo destination hai mumbai 
राइट आप दिल्ली से ट्रेन में बैठे हैं मुंबई जाने के लिए एंड यू हैव वन डेस्टिनेशन क्लियर डेस्टिनेशन कि ओके मुझे मुंबई जाना है बट दिल्ली से मुंबई जाने के रास्ते में और भी बहुत सारे प्लेटफॉर्म्स आते हैं राइट आगरा आएगा मथुरा आएगा ग्वालियर आएगा झांसी आएगा भोपाल आएगा गुजरात सो मेनी स्टेशन लेकिन क्या आप मुंबई जाने से पहले उन स्टेशन पे उतर जाते हैं आई गेस नो राइट आप कभी भी उन स्टेशन पे नहीं उतरते हैं बहुत सारे स्टेशन आते हैं आपकी डेस्टिनेशन से पहुंचने से पहले लेकिन आप कभी उन उन स्टेशन पे नहीं उतरते हैं क्यों क्योंकि आपके माइंड को क्लियर है कि ओके आई हैव टू रीच हेयर आई हैव टू गो देर सो फेलियर भी लाइफ में इसी तरीके से है फेलियर्स आर लाइक द स्टेशन यू नो वेन यू हैव वन डेस्टिनेशन इन योर हैड clear clear destination in your head in between many stations will come and those stations are like failures but if your focus is on that uh, destination on that uh, you know goal where you want to reach where you want to go then these failures are just a stoppage the so just a stoppage for few minutes or few days maybe few weeks but it it cannot uh, stop you for whole life until unless you don't decide that for yourself if you are not quitting if you are so 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 clear in your head that okay i have to reach here it means i have to reach here no matter how many stations are coming in between right so failure are exactly the same way when once you are very strong then you can reach anywhere if you are clear you can go anywhere my friend stations will keep coming right so we always hear stories about uh, success right we always hear success stories but we never hear uh, failure stories right so let's let's see some famous failures kuch famous failures ke bare mein hum ab yahan pe baat karenge kyunki success stories sab baat karte hain lekin koi nahi batata ki behind the scene actually kya hua tha behind the curtain actually kya hua tha right so let's uh, see some of the failures all right walt disney everybody very uh, you know um, it is very known name to everyone and uh, i put <laughs> disney on the first uh, because i myself is very fond of the disney characters so here is walt disney story so well as you can see fired from job saying lacked imagination and had no good ideas uh, he was actually fired from his first job my friend and in 1920 walt disney started his own company called irvix disney which was actually a failed 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 venture it was not succeeded and then 1922 he started newman lafogram and newman lafogram was exactly like the memes uh, you know aajkal hum bahut zyada memes dekhte hain internet pe it was same idea lafo uh, lafograms but uh, this company actually gone bankrupt in 1922 and then walt disney design his you know famous character mickey mouse in 1923 he designed that character in 1923 and after uh, designing that character after 5 years after 5 years his first short film uh, film was released and uh, it was a very short film it was uh, it was not very popular among people or you know children or kids but it was just released and nobody even knows that okay some mickey mouse came out but in you know after so many years in 1928 film was released but in 1978 it was the first day when mickey get famous after so many years right so it took him walt disney to uh, too many years to reach here where he is right now all right let's talk about thomas a edison everybody knows about him right thomas edison uh, teacher said he was too stupid to learn anything unhe school se nikal diya gaya tha sirf ye bol ke ki bhai aap zyada smart nahi hai you cannot learn and he was fired from his first two job for being non productive as an inventor he was fired right and made a unsuccessful attempt at inventing the light bulbs and that's thousand times hazar baar wo fail hue the actually mein hazar baar unhone try kiya tha light bulb banane ke liye agar wo hazar baar try nahi karte us time pe aur quit kar diya hota to shayad hum aaj life mein baithe hue bhi nahi hote right so it was his decision to keep going uh, to you know to keep 
his focus on the destination where he wants to reach and he was you know trying 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 even it if take a uh, thousand times uh, he still did it and when one day a reporter asked him why i mean how did it feel like to fail thousand times so what edison said edison said i didn't fail thousand times i have just found thousand other ways that just uh, don't make a light bulb right so as i earlier said um, you know for your mind it's not always about what to do it's also about what not to do right so your mind wants to learn all and everything my friend and jk rowling everybody knows right harry potter 1990 conceived the idea for harry potter series but after 90 it was not popular in very one snap but uh, like he when he gave this book to publishers the uh, 12 major publishers rejected the harry potter manuscript can you believe 12 times but still he was uh, she was very very you know uh, focused she knew where she wants to go and she keep try bill gates all right billionaire in 1975 he dropped out of college everyone knows i guess this and between 1974 and 1980 his venture taraf o data was a complete failure he started his company with his friend taraf o data but it was not uh, a successful venture and in 1995 microsoft windows version 101 was complete disaster means uh, microsoft when microsoft was launched it was not popular it was a disaster for people and they disliked it and then uh, window wasn't really hit until the release of window 3.0 in 1990 means after 5 years okay after 5 years of the release of the first version the window 3 popular so it took many years for him to reach on this position steve jobs all right in 1973 exactly same like uh, bill gates he, he is a uh, uh, dropped out uh, from college and then in 1983 his first computer apple lisa was a failure venture apple was a lisa before and it was not so popular it was absolutely failed and then in 1985 steve job was fired from the very company he began right <laughs> i i'm sure most of you knows this story so these are few people my friend these are few people that i actually added in this ppt to make you understand about the failures that people go through whenever they are on the path of success so success never comes in a very quick manner or in a very one snap it takes a lot of hard work a lot of years and uh, it's your focus it demands your focus that where your focus is right failures will keep coming into your life because failures are there to give you a learning because your mind wants to learn all and everything success as i said in the very first uh, um you know attempt of the webinar i said success is all about efficiency and it's about um, um, acceleration right it's speed so whenever failures whenever you are you are on the path of success your speed is slow right you maybe you don't do things um in that good manner like other people do but uh, when you stick on your destination when you stick on on the you know destination where you want to go then then it can give you energy to keep going but if you are focusing on the failures then maybe you quit so this is how hap it happens your mind uh, i mean your body always take the action from your mind because your mind is connected to your body through the nervous system and whatever you are doing in your life it is because you are thinking about it if you keep thinking about the failures then your body will not take any action but if you are focusing on the success or the destination or the goal then you can actually have you can have the power to keep going so always uh, bring your focus on things that you want in your life not on those things that you don't want all right so i got this quote from the internet internet that says 
if you fail never give up if you fail never give up because fail means first attempt in learning right uh, we just talked about this uh, failure means learning you always learn whenever you fail and uh, this uh, learning is about uh, this learning actually gives you speed this learning gives you acceleration this learning gives you efficiency that how efficient you are in things that you already do right so you can make yourself efficient in anything my friend so never give up just keep going this is part of the success without failing your mind actually don't take the lesson all right so why people fail why why people fail or why people don't get success in their life it is because of the fear of failure because failure is just the imagination right you are imagining those scenarios those uh, those things failures uh, that's why failures happen fear fear right fear happens in your brain and because of the fear of failures people quit and i again got this quote from the internet that says there is only one thing that makes a dream impossible to achieve and that is fear of failure my friend aksar people log aksar people aksar log apna kaam karna chhod dete hain ya fir apni dream life pe kaam karna chhod dete hain apni success is pe kaam karna chhod dete hain why because they are so afraid of the failure so afraid of the failure they are always focusing on the things that they don't want in their life but it's always about the focus where your focus goes it always expand right those things always expand if you put your focus on to that so we'll do this so fear of failure ke bare mein i would really love to tell you one thing fear is one very strong uh, emotion or I, i mean it's actually a automatic function of your brain fear is one automatic function of your brain so jo ye automatic function hai wo aapke defense ke liye bana hua hai defense means kab jab bhi aapko life mein koi threat feel hota hai ya fir aapko life mein koi bhi danger feel hota hai automatically your brain behave in a one particular manner and that is the fear that is called fear or is particular manage ek jo automatic system hai hamare body mein wo us automatic system ko hum actually mein fear bolte hain is fear mein hum ek mode mein aa jate hain fight or flight ke mode mein kyunki ye hame help karta hai us situation se bachne ke liye jis bhi situation se hum threat ya danger feel kar rahe hain to jab bhi hame kisi cheez se danger feel hota hai to aksar hamari body ya to phir freeze ho jati hai ya to phir you know flee karna chahti hai us moment mein ya to phir fight karna chahti hai right only three option hote hain fear matlab ki aapke body ka ek automatic system which is fight flight and freeze aapne aksar dekha hoga aap kabhi bhi gaadi chalate honge right jab bhi aap gaadi chalate hain aapne dekha hoga ki samne se jab bhi koi dusri gaadi aati hai aapki यू नो आप देखते हैं कि गाड़ी आ रही है और एक्सीडेंट से बचने के लिए आप एकदम से यू नो अपना स्टेयरिंग संभालते हैं और आप अपने गाड़ी के गैर को संभालते हैं ब्रेक लगाते हैं यू नो एक ऑटोमेटिक रिस्पांस आता है आपकी बॉडी का राइट सब चीजें आप एक साथ कर देते हैं एंड यू ट्राई टू सेव योर फ्रॉम दैट एक्सीडेंट राइट तो ये जो रिस्पॉन्स है ये एक्चुअली आपका फियर का रिस्पॉन्स है इस मोमेंट में आपकी बॉडी एक ऑटोमेटिक तरीके से बिहेव करती है बिकॉज इट वॉन्ट्स टू सेव यू और ये एक हमारा डिफेंस सिस्टम है विच इज विच इज देयर इन आस परमानेंटली ओके लेकिन फियर भी हमारी लाइफ में दो तरीके के होते हैं एक होता है एक इमेजिनेशन फियर और एक होता है हमारा रियल फियर रियल फियर में क्या हो गया यही सेम चीज हमारी एक्सीडेंट वाली जैसे गाड़ी से हमारा एक्सीडेंट होने वाला था एंड हमने अपने आप को सेव करने की कोशिश की तो ये हुआ हमारा रियल सिनेरियो राइट और या फिर कोई शेर वेर आ गया या कोई भालू वाले हो गए इस तरीके का डेंजर हमारे लिए रियल डेंजर है उसकी वजह से फियर हो हमारे बॉडी में तो हमें हेल्पफुल है लेकिन अगर इमेजिनेशन हमारे अगर हम किसी चीज़ को इमेजिन करके फियरफुल हो रहे हैं तो भी हमारी बॉडी में एक्चुअली सेम ही तरीके का रिस्पांस पैदा होता है फाइट फ्लाइट और फ्रीज का रिस्पांस तो ये रिस्पांस जो है किसी भी चीज से हो सकता है इमेजिनेशन तो किसी भी चीज से मे बी आपका इमेजिनेशन हो कि ओके फेर कहीं मैं 
बिजनेस में फेल ना हो जाऊं इस चीज का डर हो आपके मन में कहीं मैं इंटरव्यू देने जाऊं इंटरव्यू में फेल ना हो जाऊं उस चीज का डर हो आपके अंदर या फिर आपके अंदर डर हो इन्वेस्टमेंट करने के कहीं मैं इन्वेस्टमेंट करूँ मेरे पैसे ना डूब जाए इस तरीके का डर हो तो कोई भी डर हो ओके दीज आर सम नॉट रियल डेंजर राइट दीज आर इमेजिनेशन डेंजर इमेजिनेशन थ्रेट बट फॉर योर ब्रेन थ्रेट इज थ्रेट बिकॉज योर ब्रेन डजन अंडरस्टैंड Uh, between imagination and reality for your brain brain everything is real if you thinking about it okay if you are thinking about something your brain makes it real my friend so it doesn't understand what is imagination and reality aapke samne koi sher aa jaye us us uh us situation mein bhi aapki body usi tarike se behave karegi jis tarike se aapki body us dar mein karegi jo aap mehsoos kar rahe hain apne business ko start करने से पहले ऑल राइट सो यू आर ऑलवेज फीलिंग द सेम फियर सो फियर में क्या होता है आपकी बॉडी कप कपाने लगती है राइट right? चाहे किसी भी डर का डर हो शेर आ जाए तभी भी आपकी बॉडी में वो शेकिंग और वो जो कप कपानापन होगा वो होगा और आपके यू नो बिजनेस स्टार्ट करने से पहले भी ये कप कपाहट जो होती है जो शेकिंग होती है इट्स द फियर इट्स द यू नो इट्स हाउ बॉडी बिहेव इन द फियर तो फियर को हमें अगर अपने लाइफ से खत्म करना है तो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल हमें क्या करना होगा हमें अपने दिमाग को हमारे ब्रेन को वो देना शुरू करना होगा जो कि हम अपनी लाइफ में चाहते हैं क्योंकि फियर माय फ्रेंड फियर विल नेवर एवर लेट यू टेक एक्शन एक्चुअली जब भी हम फियर में होते हैं हमारा जो ये थिंकिंग पार्ट है जो हमारा क्रिटिकल थिंकिंग पार्ट है ये एब्सोल्युटली ब्लॉक हो जाता है इसलिए आपने देखा होगा कि आप इंटरव्यू से जब भी इंटरव्यू देने से डर रहे हैं तो आपको समझ में नहीं आता कि मैं क्या करूं क्या नहीं करूं क्या करूं क्या बोलूँ क्या नहीं बोलूँ इवन यू नो ऑल द आंसर्स इन योर हेड यू नो ऑल एंड एवरी थिंग बट योर फियर your fear don't let you take the action your fear don't let you take the you know right decision because this decision part ye jo hamara forehead is ye jo frontal lobe hai this is uh, this part is actually responsible for the decision making aur jab bhi hum decision lete hain to fear mein to decision le hi nahi sakte because ye part completely shut off ho jata hai so maybe you understand yourself better from this always fear jo hai wo aapke andar शेकिंग पैदा करेगा आपको डिसीजन नहीं लेने देगा एंड मे बी यू आप यू बिकम कम्प्लीटली नम और फ्रीज और पैरालाइज ऐसे ही होता है राइट बिजनेस शुरू करना है बिजनेस शुरू करने का डर है समझ ही नहीं आया क्या करूं क्या नहीं करूं इन्वेस्टमेंट करनी है क्या करूं क्या नहीं करूं राइट right? आप कम्प्लीटली फ्रीज हो जाते हैं क्योंकि उस टाइम पे तो ये जो फियर है ये आपको आगे बढ़ने ही नहीं देता है तो फियर को जो है जो फेलियर का जो फियर है उसे हमें अपने अंदर से निकालना होगा राइट सो आई एम गोइंग टू डू वन वेरी पावरफुल एन एल पी टेक्निक हेयर विद यू गाइज टू ओवरकम फियर ऑफ फेलियर सो लेट मी हेयर फ्रॉम यू आई यू गाइज लिसनिंग आई यू हेयर विद मी एंड आई यू इंटरेस्टेड टू डू दिस पावरफुल टेक्निक Let me hear from you. Yes, no, yes, no. Whatever yes, you feel. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes. Okay. Yes, okay. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. So we'll do one NLP technique. So it's ne kya karna hoga? Apko kisi bhi ek situation because hamari life me bahot sari alag alag situation hai. Hamay alag alag situation se dar lagta hai, right? तो कोई भी लाइफ की एक सिचुएशन आपको सिलेक्ट करनी है कोई भी एक सिचुएशन मे बी इट इज रिलेटेड टू योर करियर योर जॉब योर बिजनेस योर रिलेशनशिप योर हेल्थ और वट इट इज जस्ट टेक वन सिचुएशन आउट ऑफ एनी एरिया ऑफ योर लाइफ एंड वील वॉक ऑन दैट वन एरिया और राइट क्योंकि एक टाइम में हम एक ही एक ही सिचुएशन पे काम कर सकते हैं बट यू विल लर्न दिस टेक्निक सो दैट यू कैन डू इट लेटर ऑन इन योर लाइफ माई फ्रेंड और राइट तो मे बी आपका कोई भी डर हो सकता है पब्लिक स्पीकिंग का डर हो शायद आपके मन में शायद आपके मन में डर हो इंटरव्यू देने का शायद आपके मन में हो डर नया बिजनेस स्टार्ट करने का तो जो भी आपका डर है ओके okay? एक सिचुएशन जस्ट टेक वन सिचुएशन आउट ऑफ योर लाइफ एंड वी विल वर्क ऑन दैट आर वी रेडी यस परफेक्ट परफेक्ट सो व्हाट यू हैव टू डू जस्ट वेर एवर यू आर जस्ट सिट विद योर स्पाइन स्ट्रेट मेक योर स्पाइन स्ट्रेट Uh, spine, my friend, because your spine is connected to your brain, and your brain and body is connected to each other with this very powerful spine. 
सो so, आपके स्पाइन और आपके अगर आपके बॉडी और आपके माइंड के बीच में आपको एक परफेक्ट हार्मोनी परफेक्ट कनेक्शन चाहिए सो योर स्पाइन शुड बी एब्सोल्युटली स्ट्रेट आपने अक्सर देखा होगा कॉन्फिडेंट लोग जितने भी होते हैं उनकी स्पाइन हमेशा स्ट्रेट होती है राइट right? तो उनकी स्पाइन स्ट्रेट होने के पीछे का यही राज है बिकॉज दे वर्क सो हार्ड ऑन दैट देर माइंड एंड बॉडी इज ऑटोमेटिकली कनेक्टेड दे टेक डिसीजन एंड दे टेक एक्शन ऐसा नहीं कि डिसीजन ले लिया अपने आप से जो वादा किया वो ही तोड़ दिया राइट दे टेक डिसीजन वेर दे टेक डिसीजन इन देर हेड राइट एंड वेर दे टेक एक्शन फ्रॉम फ्रॉम देर बॉडी सो योर माइंड बॉडी शुड बी इन वन हार्मनी एंड दैट हार्मनी कॉम्स वेन योर स्पाइन इज एब्सोल्यूटली इरेक्ट और और स्ट्रेट सो कीप योर स्पाइन स्ट्रेट सिट सिट प्रॉपरली straight whether on anywhere you can sit on your bed on chair on zameen uh, wherever you want just sit with your spine straight kahin bhi baith sakte hain aap okay kursi pe bhi ho sofa pe bhi ho bed pe bhi ho zameen pe ho kahin pe bhi just sit all right i hope we are ready now just uh, close your eyes close your eyes and bring your focus on your breathing take one deep breath in fill your belly and now breathe out take one more deep breath fill your belly breathe out we'll take one more deep breath in the breath in belly out hold your breath for 1 2 3 4 5 breathe out now again hold your breath on breathe out 1 2 3 4 5 relax <clears throat> we'll take one more deep breath in we one more deep breath in belly out hold your breath for 1 2 3 4 5 5 breathe out and hold your breath out 1 2 3 4 5 5 relax now completely bring your focus on your breathing and on your my voice now we will think of that one situation one situation that we are afraid of one situation from our life any area of our life maybe from our career job business relationship finances or health think of that one area think of that one situation jisse aapko bahut dar lagta ho आपकी लाइफ का वन सिचुएशन थिंक ऑफ दैट इमेजिन पिक्चर आपकी आंखों के सामने आने चाहिए क्या है वो सिचुएशन क्या वो पब्लिक स्पीकिंग का डर है आपको दिख रहा है कि क्या आप स्टेज पे जाते हैं और आप डरते हैं स्टेज पे जाने से पहले लोगों का सामना करने से पहले थिंक ऑफ दैट वन सिचुएशन जिस सिचुएशन से आपको डर लगता है क्या है वो सिचुएशन उस सिचुएशन की सारी इमेजेस अपने आंखों के सामने लेके आइए उस टाइम पे आप कैसा फील कर रहे हैं फील दैट हाउ यू आर फीलिंग इन द सिचुएशन थिंक ऑफ दैट वन सिचुएशन दैट मेक्स यू फियरफुल now feel all the feelings that you are feeling right now in this situation what you are feeling is it your stomach that is disturbing you is it your chest that is going down or it is your shoulder that is shrinking aap apne body mein kis jagah is fear ko feel kar sakte hain where you are feeling this right now is situation mein ये सिचुएशन जिससे आपको बहुत डर लगता है इस सिचुएशन में आप कैसा फील कर रहे हैं क्या आपके पेट में आप ये डर फील कर सकते हैं या आपकी छाती में या आपके नेक में या आपके शोल्डर में वेर कैन यू फील दिस 
डर लगने पे हमेशा हमारी बॉडी एक तरीके से बिहेव करती है ब्रिंग योर फोकस ऑन द फियर वेर इज दिस फियर इज सिटिंग इन योर बॉडी फील इट फील इट फील द फियर फील द फियर इन योर बॉडी फील इट now take one deep breath in and take all the fear in this breath take all the fear from every part of your body wherever you are feeling fear just take all the fear feeling in this breath and now just throw it out breathe out with a full force <sighs> take one more deep breath wherever you are feeling this fear in your body collect all the feelings in your breathing wherever you are feeling this fear collect all the feelings in your breath and breathe out <sighs> now you are feeling relaxed now you are feeling calm now you are feeling grounded now take the same situation same situation that was making you fearful before now take the same situation and imagine all the good possibilities all the good possibilities that can happen in this situation think of all those things that can make this situation positive to you that can make this situation more powerful more more fulfilled think of all the scenarios think all the colors in this picture think of all the good colors wherever you are you are you sitting are you standing what people are saying in your ears about this situation what people are saying to you i are, are they congratulating you are they praising you what are the good words that people are saying to you in this situation think of all the good situation all the good scenarios in this situation that was making you fearful before now feel this good feelings feel this good emotions in your body feel feel it everywhere feel how people are congratulating you how people are saying good words to you listen to those words listen to them listen to all the people see the colors see all the colors in this picture how you are feeling are you happy or are you super happy feel this excitement in you now you can do it now you know how to do it now you know people are actually appreciating you for doing this job feel the good emotions feel the good feeling feel all and everything all and every positive feel all the good things all right now slowly come to the awareness and slowly open your eyes all right so how was the exercise guys are you back 
Are you guys back? So yes. Yes. How was the experience? Yes, How was the experience for you? Nice, nice. How was the experience for you guys? Did you feel empowered? Power. Fantastic, ma'am. Excited, happy, joyful, relaxed. How you are feeling now? Relaxed. Reconnected to my dreams. So now, now the you know whatever the situation was uh, used to make you feel before, is it making you feel the same way? No, ma'am. No, ma'am. Okay. So you can repeat this exercise as many times as you want to, you know, to make yourself more empowered, to make yourself more powerful towards, you know, achieving your goals, your aims and your success. All right, my friend. So let's talk about the take home message. So take home message for you is figure out where the fear comes from. Actually, our under jo bhi fear hai, jaisa bhi fear hai is time pe. Ya to fir wo aaya hai hamari family se, ya hamari friends se, ya hamari colleagues se, ya fir society se. Jo bhi fear hai hamari under that always came from some somebody else outside of us because we always feel we can do it, but somewhere we stop ourselves, you know, by thinking that what people are going to think they because they have already said this can happen so maybe this can happen so i should quit or i should not do it right so we all whatever fear we have right now that is uh, that is you know because of the outside scenarios or outside things that we hear or experience so figure out where your fear came from because once you know where your fear came from, then you can ac actually say to yourself that, okay, I have this fear because my friends feel this way, because my colleagues feel this way, because my parents feel this way, or society feels this way. But I myself feel differently. I feel this can happen and this can, I can make this happen. All right. So that's why it is really important to figure out where your fear came from all right so whatever fear in you sit with yourself meditate for 10 15 minutes um, you know 5 10 minutes and just think of all those fear that you have then you know take one fear uh, in one moment take one fear at one moment and work on it not all the fear don't work on all the fear in one time just take one fear and then work on that all right one by one by one slowly slowly you it's you know like uh, clearing your uh, files from your computer or from your mobile you clear all the files one by one by one yeah uh, so you know in your mind also you know, from your brain also you have to clear all the files one by one so take one fear and clear it take one fear and clear it all right reframe your beliefs about your goals whatever your goals uh, right now may if you Think if you are feeling about your goals in a negative way, then take those negative beliefs um, and uh, make them positive. All right. And number th third is learn to think positively because positive thinking positive is actually not some philosophy, my friend. It is science because your body always doing those things that your mind is thinking about. If your mind is thinking that you can't do it, your body actually will not take any action to do it. But if you have thought that you can do it, your body automatically will start working on that thing. So your body her action means your mind, your brain, ka, right? So whatever you are thinking, uh, just pause for a moment and think if you are thinking in a positive manner or in a negative manner all right and then whatever you are feeling if this is negative then just change your thinking just change one thought and make it positive and automatically you will start uh, feeling positive you because your emotions and your feelings are also uh, made by your thoughts and your thinking okay so learn to think positive because everything is a is a practice if you are if you, you know, if you think negatively, then my friend, you were 
not negative from the beginning. Uh, you actually learn to think uh, negatively. So now when you can learn to think negatively, so you can learn to think positively as well. So it's a process, it's a journey and it's like, you know, it, it can take a lot of patience. So it's OK, just keep doing it and you you'll become master into that. And number four is visualize all the potential outcomes because as a human being, you are unlimited, right? You can think of anything and you can do anything. You can make anything possible. Uh, whatever uh, we have right now in this world, whether it is mobile or this light or, you know, satellites or TV, Wi-Fi, whatever we have, you know, whatever, uh, luxurious life we are enjoying right now it is because somewhere sometime think about that thing and then they make it happen right so everything start with a thought so uh, visualize uh, you know good scenarios uh, good uh, pictures uh, and good outcomes that can happen and that uh, that can take you towards your goal or towards your success all right my friend so this is your takeaway home message now it is the time for the Q&A, yay. So what questions you have for me? So now because I cannot read your questions, so one by one you can open your mic and ask me anything. Uh, Monica, Vijit here, I have a question for you. Yes, Vijit. Uh, Monica, actually I heard, uh, I attended a like, similar kind of uh, webinar like almost uh, a week back that was conducted mm -hmm. by one of the leading BPO companies, but they were conducting it like it was an open open webinar for all the BPO employees throughout the Delhi and here. So mm -hmm. I heard a term there that I did not understand, but I think uh, that is something which is related to the same thing. So that was some were kind of like, you know, uh, reconnect. Uh, mm -hmm. Like okay. so, what what exactly is that? If you can, I I know that is that has uh, way less to do with the the thing, but still. But your question is. Uh, like, it, my question basically is uh, like the thing that you just told me and uh, told all of us, right? Basically, like fa failures are the pillar of success, or the they're in the path of success, right? They are uh, they fall within the path of success. So uh, does that have something to do with the reconnect kind of things? like uh, reconnect reconnect with what reconnect with the the ideas or the or the dreams like if you remember if you remember a few minutes back i said i'm feeling reconnected to my dreams right uh -huh. and uh, yes i was able to do that but uh, does that really practically happen because you, what you said now, on a emotional ground that was yes good to hear but on, on a practical ground not all the things were applicable okay. As I said, as I said, my friend, you, my, your body is connected to your brain, all right? Mm -hmm. Whatever goes in your brain, mm -hmm. your body automatically takes action towards it, okay? Mm -hmm. Your body automatically takes the action. Somewhere your brain, whenever you start doing few things, I mean, if something is new to you, new. Mm -hmm. If something is new to you, you don't know all the aspects and all the perception all of that one thing that you are mm -hmm. starting. But once you start your journey, your mind start to learn all and everything. As I uh, mentioned before, if you can understand Hindi, if I if I can speak in Hindi. Maybe ask for message now. Okay. So uh, because. As I said, I have uh, mentioned that you have to learn how to learn from your mind. You have to eat your food directly in your mind. Right? You have to eat your food in your mouth, sometimes 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 in your mouth, and then finally you have to learn from your mind. You have to learn from your mind. Okay, मुझे चीजें कैसे करनी है ये भी जानना है और कैसे नहीं करनी है ये भी पता होना चाहिए, right? Because mm -hmm. whoever is senior to you, okay, whoever are the masters uh, right now in the society or in the world, they all know how to do things, and they also know how not to do same thing, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So your mind actually works in this manner only. Your mind wants to learn all and everything. Mm -hmm. So once you start thinking about what you want in your life, then your body feel empowered. You start taking action. And when you start taking action, maybe, uh, you know, you can fall one time, two times, three times, uh, five times. But my friend, seven time or eighth time, your mm -hmm. mind knows uh, how to stand properly without falling down. Mm -hmm. Okay. So it's a process. It's a process. Your mind wants to learn all and everything. So 
and you mod because your body takes all the action from your brain so whatever you think in your brain your body takes a- mm-hmm. action according to that right जैसे मैंने बताया था कि अगर आपने सोच लिया कि मैं नहीं कर सकता तो आप कभी उसके लिए एक्शन लेते ही नहीं है बट इज इट ट्रू इज इट ट्रू कि आप नहीं कर सकते अगर मैं आपको बोलूं कि एक करोड़ रुपए मैं आपको दे रही हूँ विनीत जस्ट टेक दिस वन करोड़ रुपए एंड डू दिस इम्पॉसिबल थिंग यूल से येस आई डू इट राइट बिकॉज नाउ वेन नो बट इज गिविंग यू एनी रिवॉर्ड यू फील लाइक ओके लेट्स जस्ट नॉट डू इट बिकॉज आई फील आई कैन नॉट डू इट बट एज अन बींग यू कैन डू ऑल इन एवरी राइट 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 बट बट मोनिका मेरा क्वेश्चन यहाँ पे शायद मैं सही से फ्रेम नहीं कर पाया मैं इसको थोड़ा अलग तरीके से देखिए हर आदमी के पास कैपेबिलिटीज uh, हर चीज को करने की नहीं होती है हर आदमी कैपेबिलिटीज अलग अलग होती हैं करेक्ट मी फ्रॉम यू कैन लर्न एनी एनी वन कैन लर्न एनीथिंग राइट इफ यू आर थिंकिंग ऑफ बिकमिंग समथिंग राइट आई एम नॉट थिंकिंग ऑफ बिकमिंग दैट थिंग व्हाट एवर यू आर थिंकिंग ऑफ बिकमिंग मे बी यू आर थिंकिंग ऑफ बिकमिंग अ सिंगर बट आई एम नॉट थिंकिंग अबाउट बिकमिंग अ सिंगर बट समवेयर आई फील you know okay i cannot do it i want to become sing- singer but i am feeling i cannot do it that how can i become singer how can i become that you know what i want to uh, become right so for mm-hmm. that first step is start thinking what you want to do okay. start thinking because that's the first process that's the foundation mm-hmm. if you are not thinking of uh, you know you have to be very very clear what you want in your life then automatically you will find the ways because your mind always find the ways okay. you always find bahanas for not doing things right you mm-hmm. have bahanas for not doing things am i right, right. or wrong right yeah, right har kisi ke paas mein bahana hai kaam na karne ka wo kaise aata hai because your mind works usi tarike se aapka jo mind hai wo usi tarike se kaam karta hai jo aapne usko force diya aapka mind usko karne ke na aapko bahut sare bahane de dega मतलब ये भी एक्शन ही हुआ ना ना करना भी एक तरीके का एक्शन ही है अगर आपने सोचा कि मैं नहीं कर सकता आपका माइंड बहुत सारे बहाने दे देगा ओके क्योंकि मेरे फ्रेंड ने बोला मैं नहीं कर सकता और क्योंकि मुझे आता ही नहीं है मैं नहीं कर सकता मैंने पहले नहीं किया इसीलिए अफकोर्स मैं नहीं कर सकता तो बहुत सारी इस तरीके की चीजें आएंगी आपके यू नो माइंड में मतलब एक के बाद एक बहुत सारा माइंड आपको यू नो मटेरियल दे देगा कि भाई क्यों ये चीज पॉसिबल नहीं है आपके लिए उसी तरीके से जब आप सोचना शुरू करेंगे ना कि मुझे ये चीज करनी है तो आपका माइंड ऑटोमेटिकली आपको आइडियाज देना शुरू कर देगा क्योंकि भाई ये चीज कैसे पॉसिबल है आपको वो आइडियाज आना शुरू हो जाएंगे कि ये चीज कैसे पॉसिबल है अगर मैं ये सोचता हूँ कि ये पॉसिबल है तो कैसे पॉसिबल है योर माइंड विल ऑटोमेटिकली गिव यू आइडिया दैट्स बिकॉज दैट्स हाउ योर माइंड वर्क दैट्स हाउ अूमन माइंड वर्क चाहे आप नेगेटिवली सोच लो चाहे आप पॉजिटिवली सोच लो हर चीज के लिए आपको बहाने मिल जाएंगे ना करने के भी बहाने मिल जाएंगे और करने के भी बहाने मिल जाएंगे मींस आपका माइंड आपको हर चीज के बहाने दे देगा कि भाई कैसे करना है और कैसे नहीं भी करना है क्या मैंने क्या मैं आपको क्लियर uh, कर पाई थैंक्स अलॉट राइट सो दैट्स हाउ यू माइंड वर्क सो यू ऑल यू नो यू जस्ट हैव टू स्टार्ट थिंकिंग and just you know be clear on what you want and your mind will automatically gives you idea how to make it possible okay. all right my friend thank you do we have any other question yes ma'am hello ma'am ishika here yes hi ishika han ji uh, ma'am my fear of failure is um, how can we know if our efforts is in right direction or wrong मतलब हमें पता है कि हाँ भी कुछ लोग फेल भी हुए हैं और कुछ आगे तक भी गए हैं तो हमें hmm. कैसे पता लगे आगे तक हम जा मतलब हिम्मत पूरी है कर एफर्ट्स पूरे हैं करना जरूर है पर आगे तक जो रास्ता है वो सही है कि नहीं ये चीज नहीं समझ आ रही सी देर इज नो सही एंड देर इज नो रॉन्ग माई फ्रेंड अगर आप सही और गलत में फंसे रहेंगे ना तो आप कभी काम कर ही नहीं पाएंगे तो ये आपको ये नहीं सोचना है कि सही और गलत क्या है आपको जस्ट ये सोचना है कि जो आपका फर्स्ट क्लियर होना चाहिए कि व्हाट एग्जैक्टली यू वांट इन योर लाइफ और जहां आपके पास वो क्लियर हुआ और उसके बाद में जो भी काम आप कर रहे हैं जो भी काम कर रहे हैं क्या वो आपको उस यू नो डेस्टिनेशन पर पहुँचा रहा है जहाँ पहुंचना चाहते हैं क्या उस करियर बिजनेस या यू नो सक्सेस की तरफ आपको ले जा रहे हैं आपके एक्शन वो सही और गलत होता है बिकॉज सही और गलत हम दोनों के लिए अलग अलग है जो चीज आपके लिए सही होगी वो शायद मेरे लिए गलत हो सकती है और जो मेरे लिए गलत हो शायद वो आपके लिए सही हो सकती है तो गलत सही के पीछे नहीं पड़ना है हमको उस चीज के पीछे पड़ना है कि जो भी मैं एक्शन अपनी लाइफ में ले रही हूँ क्या वो एक्शन मुझे उस डेस्टिनेशन पे पहुंचा रहे हैं जहां मैं पहुंचना चाहती हूँ 
चाहे वो कोई भी पाथ हो चाहे वो सिंगर बनना हो चाहे वो पब्लिक स्पीकर बनना हो चाहे वो अपना खुद का बिजनेस खोलना हो चाहे अपने लिए यू नो एक नई पोजीशन क्रिएट करना हो सी ओ मैनेजर वट एवर सो आई यू एक्शन टेकिंग यू टू दैट पाथ ऑल यू हैव टू नो दिस दैट्स इट ओके मैम जब से मतलब बड़े हुए हैं तो एक एग्जांपल जरूर सुना है कि कील नहीं अगर दीवार में जा रही तो उसको उल्टा कर लो तब जाएगी दैट uh, मींस कि हमारे एफर्ट ही गलत जा रहे हैं तभी वो काम नहीं कर रही तो ये चीज ना हमेशा दिमाग में रहती है क्या वही काम मेरे साथ तो नहीं हो रहा कि मेरी की ओके हम वही तो कैसे पता चलेगा लेकिन अगर कील को कील अगर दूसरे तरफ से नहीं जा रही है तो उसके लिए भी तो मुझे एक्शन लेना ही पड़ेगा ना एक्शन तो लेना ही पड़ेगा चाहे जो भी हो जाए वो तो उसके बाद होने के बाद आपको पता चलेगा कि भाई ये एक्शन रॉन्ग हुआ या राइट right हुआ इसे ही तो फेलियर्स बोलते हैं एक्चुअली में कोई भी हमने एक्शन लिया और वो हमारा राइट right या रॉन्ग हो गया मतलब रॉन्ग इसलिए कि भाई हमें उस जो भी हमने एक्शन लिया उस एक्शन ने हमें उस डेस्टिनेशन पर नहीं पहुँचाया जिस डेस्टिनेशन पर हम पहुँचना चाहते थे इस तरीके से नहीं काम किया जाता तो मतलब आपको उसके लिए एक्शन लेना ही पड़ेगा फिर भी है ना एक्शन लेना ही पड़ेगा एक्शन जब हो जाएगा उसके बाद में आपको पता चलेगा कि भाई ये मेरे काम का हुआ है या नहीं हुआ है कई कई बार यू वॉन्ट बिलीव आई राइट ब्लॉग्स ओके इवन आई राइट मैंने बुक भी लिखी है तो मैं जब मैंने फर्स्ट जब अपनी बुक लिखी थी तो मुझे लग रहा था कि मैंने क्या ये मैंने सही लिखी है बुक क्या लोगों को पसंद आएगी तो मैंने अपनी बुक को कम से कम 20 बार एडिट किया होगा यू वॉन्ट बिलीव 20 बार यू नो पूरे 150 पेजेस कैन यू इमेजिन स्टार्ट टू एंड 20 टाइम्स मुझे छह महीने अपनी बुक को री राइट करने में चला गया सिर्फ के कि मैं यू नो दोबारा से कर लूँ दोबारा से कर लूँ दोबारा से कर लूँ सही हुआ है या नहीं हुआ है गलत हुआ है या क्या इस तरीके से तो ड्यूरिंग दैट टाइम वॉट आई लर्न फॉर माई सेल्फ कि जो भी आप कर रहे हैं ना जस्ट टेक एक्शन क्योंकि छः महीने मुझे सिर्फ और सिर्फ उसको री एडिट री एडिट री एडिट री एडिट करने में चलेगा कि पता नहीं पसंद आएगा नहीं आएगा गलत हुआ है सही हुआ है ऐसे करके और मैं उसे री राइट करती थी और मैंने पब्लिश ही नहीं किया और लेकिन वहाँ से मैंने सीखा कि जो भी फर्स्ट अटैम्प्ट आप करते हैं ना जो भी करने का मन हो वो आप कर दो ओके और वो भी फर्स्ट अटैम्प्ट में कर दो ना ये सोचो कि आप परफेक्ट हैं उसमें या नहीं है और ना ना ये सोचो कि क्या आप उसमें गलत हैं या सही है क्योंकि आप जब पाथ पे चलते रहेंगे यू ऑटोमेटिकली लर्न यू ऑटोमेटिकली लर्न कि ओके ठीक है भाई इस तरीके से काम नहीं किया जाता इस तरीके से काम करना चाहिए बिकॉज दैट्स वॉट यू माइंड वॉन्ट्स टू लर्न राइट सो कीप डूइंग कीप डूइंग इज द ओनली की टू सक्सेस अगर आपको पहुंचना है तो करते रहो बिना ये सोचे कि भी आप परफेक्ट हो या नहीं हो बिकॉज परफेक्शनिज्म कब आता है जब आप उस चीज़ को लगातार बार बार करते रहते हैं मे बी आपका आपने राइटिंग शुरू की फर्स्ट ब्लॉग आपका इतना पॉपुलर नहीं रहा सेकेंड ब्लॉग इतना पॉपुलर नहीं रहा लेकिन लेकिन सेकेंड ब्लॉग जो होगा वो आपका फर्स्ट ब्लॉग से बेटर होगा राइट यस मैम सो कीप डूइंग और सेकेंड जो भी आप करेंगे वो आपका फर्स्ट से बेहतर ही होगा मैं जब ऑनलाइन कोर्सेज भी बना रही थी इवन आई मेरा जो पहला कोर्स है वो इतना अमेजिंग इतना फैंटेस्टिक इतना बढ़िया नहीं था जितना कि एक्चुअली मेरा अभी ये जो थर्ड मैंने लॉन्च किया है थर्ड में आई हैव यू नो कॉन्फिडेंस और मेरे को विश्वास है कि दिस इज बेटर देन द फर्स्ट वन और इसमें मैंने बहुत ज़्यादा अच्छे चेंजेस भी किए कुछ अलग तरीके से चीज़ें करी और प्लस मतलब कि ज़्यादा अच्छा मटेरियल निकल के आया है उसका तो इसी तरीके से आपको कुछ चीज़ें लगातार करनी पड़ती हैं ये जानने के लिए कि भाई क्या कुछ बेटर कर सकते हैं आप आगे फ्यूचर में मतलब एज अ ह्यूमन बीइंग आप हमेशा ग्रो कर सकते हैं हमेशा हमेशा ग्रो कर सकते हैं लेकिन उसके लिए पहले स्टार्ट तो करना पड़ेगा ना तो स्टार्ट करना है आ, चाहे आपको जितना मर्जी डर लग रहा हो हाथ शेक कर रहे हो आप घबरा रहे हो घबराहट के साथ करो डर के साथ करो लेकिन वो फर्स्ट स्टेप लो फर्स्ट स्टेप लो उसके बाद में जस्ट यू नो वट एवर यू नो इफ यू आर इन टू राइटिंग की फर्स्ट ब्लॉग लिखना है ओके ठीक है फर्स्ट ब्लॉग लिखा लोगों को दे दिया उसके बाद उनके फीडबैक्स लिए क्रिटिसिज्म uh, एक्चुअली कहीं भी, भी नहीं आता है हमेशा फीडबैक ही होता है तो लोगों से अगर क्रिटिसिज्म भी आ रहा है तो उसे भी फीडबैक लेकर के चलना है और देखना है कि ओके नाउ वट आई कैन डू बेटर नेक्स्ट टाइम दैट्स हाउ यू बिकम एक्सपर्ट Okay, ma'am. Thank you so much. My pleasure. Anybody else? Do we have any other questions? Mm, yes. Ma'am, how can we keep ourselves motivated during this journey to success? Because uh, sometimes we get failures, and then we stop doing whatever we want or whatever we want to achieve. So, how can we motivate ourselves? What to say ourselves? 
Okay. Always remind yourself about the achievements. Always remind yourself about the achievements. Don't remind yourself about the failures. Because your mind, as I said, you know, five minutes back, your mind always gives you things that is related to first phrase or first thought. So, always remind failures ke bare mein na de karke, hamesha un cheezo ke bare mein soche jo apne life mein already achieved ki hain. So, okay, okay. अगर मैं इस बार फेल हो गई सो वॉट मैं देखो इसमें भी पास हुई थी मैंने ये भी करा हुआ है मैंने ये भी अचीव किया है मैंने ये भी किया है ये भी किया तो मैं ये भी कर सकती हूँ राइट तो इस तरीके से हमेशा अपने दिमाग को अपने माइंड को बताते रहो बिकॉज यू माइंड डजेंट नो द डिफ्रेंशिएशन बिटवीन रियालिटी एंड इमेजिनेशन इट्स यू हु इट्स बिलीव ओके तो आप जब uh, अपने अचीवमेंट्स के बारे में सोचेंगे यू योर ब्रेन ऑटोमेटिकली फील एम्पावर Okay, very simple trick. Thank you, ma'am. So thank you so much. And uh, if you guys have any question or any doubt, whatever, if in future you wants to ask anything, you can always stay connected with me. These are my social media handles. So you can simply stay connected. All right. So thank you so much. Uh, this is all for today.